Day 2, Uncle Jojo, or oh, Jika, to another Root Roaring episode. Been asked a couple of questions about using treated pine under the floor. I've mentioned a couple of times I've been using treated pine under the floor in this bathroom area. Due to a lot of building defects happening because of faults in waterproofing, but even worse still, waterproofing being installed properly, but the build itself moving, so structurally moving, and with that movement, splitting some of that waterproofing. If just by chance that does happen, and you get water regressing into the structure, it can rot the structure away, and if there's rot in the structure, it becomes structurally inadequate, which means it will start to fall apart and become very unsafe. So I use treat, treated pine in my wet areas as often as I can to make sure that if there is by chance, it's a, it's a bit of an ace exercise, ass covering exercise, because if there is water in there by chance that escapes and sits to soak into that timber, it doesn't rot it away, it's treated timber. So I use a H3 treated timber. If you're not sure about the timbers and their treatments, I do have a video on this channel subscribe and you'll be able to see all of them. So check that out, check it, check that out. And you can see the different types of treatments that we do and all of those kind of things for our treated pines. So next time you're looking at putting timber in a wet area, think about using treated pines. Now, within saying that, also be careful because treated timbers are injected with chemicals and they off gas. VOC, volatile organic compounds, they off gas chemical compounds into the air. If when you're cutting them, if you're breathing them in or you've got it all over your hands, you're not wearing gloves and things, you can get quite sick. So be very conscious of it. I'm not saying you can't use bare hands using it, but just wash or um, sanitize the hands. Don't touch your face and all that. You can end up with rashes, you can get burnt skin, all of those kind of things. So be conscious of what you're working with and how you're working. Thanks for watching. Any questions or queries regarding treated timbers, underfloors, ventilation systems, underfloors, well, you know who to come to. Uncle Joey Jojo. He can help you out. Like always, stay on real banana peels and I'll see you in the soup.